What is up, my edges? We're back with another episode of Chrono Trigger. I gotta tell you, I'm a bit excited today. Last time we had quite, quite the twist. We faced the Fiend Lord and won. But then we woke up in 65 million BC. And we were told that the, uh... Well, that's the nest. We were told that the village to the north was on fire and I believe this is this is that reptites take Kino reptites kill all try stop reptites what do now well my friend I don't know what we do now but hopefully it involves succeeding oh here we go Sarah, this is your fault. Look at village. Reptites follow you. Now village ruined. Uh-oh. Sorry. Reptites strong live long before us. So we hide, but Sarah say fight together. Sarah stay, still say fight now. Sarah alive, Sarah fight. Win, live, lose, die. That rule. No, no can change rule. Old man breathe, but dead inside. Sarah strong, so make big talk. We not strong. No, strong. Fight. Get more strong. Sarah help, but now need dactyl. Give dactyl. Dactyl. Okay, go to the lair. The lair, reptite castle. Danger, even Sarah danger. Sarah won't die. Man, this dialogue. No, we want to live, so let's go. I'll be okay. Give me Dactyl. <laughs> yes, give Dactyl. Elder will tell Keeper. That's it. Oh, that's him. So go go to the nest. Be careful. You've been a big help. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. I'm guessing we now need to go to the Dactyl nest, which is up here. How are we doing on health and stuff? We're fine. We healed. Okay, well, we've actually kind of been here. As funny as that sounds, um, because I accidentally got lost that one time and ended up coming here instead of going to, like, god, I don't know, five other areas in between. No, don't attack that one. Okay, as soon as we kill the rocks, he won't have anything to throw at us. Which is what we hope for. And then from here they just sort of crumple. Cool, this is a lot easier than last time. Last time these were basically mini bosses. So I'm glad to see that we are capable of handling these now that we're, ran that we're actually here on purpose. Wow, these are tough. Cool, get some experience. So, last time we went through a gate with the Fiend Lord, and we woke up and there weren't any, there wasn't a Fiend Lord anymore. So, I don't know what that's about. I was looking into it though, and apparently, since we defeated the Fiend Lord, there's like all kinds of little Easter eggs. Like if you go back to the the Fiend Village in 600 or or 1000 or whatever, uh, they aren't celebrating or like worshiping a statue of the Fiend Lord anymore. They're worshiping a statue of Ozzy because he survived, which is kind of cool. We don't need to go talk about, or we don't need to go there and see it but maybe we will later I just thought that was really interesting as I was uh, getting a feel for where to go in this episode I thought that was kind of interesting the the fluidity of the uh... okay we have to go to that staircase uh, the fluidity of the storyline now these guys are gonna these guys are more than capable of just 
throwing themselves at like each other at us. Wow, ice too. First time. Not, not that great. At least not against these guys. Let's just gang up on one. Ooh, now that was an that was an attack. That was just a regular basic attack from him. That's amazing. Frogman is the real deal. I wonder if Masamune is just really good against these, because these are like prehistoric fiends. At least that's my guess. I don't actually know if that's the case. But it makes sense, right? Yeah, screw you, rocks. I'm not here for you. Okay, two good hits. That's all we need for those. We might... Mm, do we want to do an Aura Whirl? Maybe. Before we head out of here. Yeah. Yeah, Frogman can literally just destroy anything he wants here. Okay. Interesting. I'm guessing we're gonna ride those. So they're pterodactyls. That's what they were referring to. Soren! You better not even think about going without us. No! Conrado, where? Danger! You cannot come. Maybe I'll die. That's fine. If it's that dangerous, we definitely can't let you go alone. You've done a lot for us, Sarah. Now it's payback time. Right, Soren? Why, why are you ringing me into this? Sarah, have good friend. Hell yeah, come on, man. Let's do this. Come on, Sarah, let's go to the Tyranno Lair. Um, I mean, honestly, I still just really like having Clara in the party. But... With Sarah having healing and Pete being just a powerhouse, I think we're going to take him instead. Because we have to have Sarah, so we don't have a choice there. Ooh, another cutscene. I still, I still really like the fact that they did it this way. Hell yeah. I think the most interesting part of this is that um, you there's no voice acting or anything like that. Like the game is purely just some sounds and and graphics. That's about it. Which I just think I think that's so cool. Is this it? I don't. How do we land? <laughs> uh. This is kind of cool, but... I'm just flying around. I'm gonna guess that this is it, because this looks like... Yeah, this is the village, and then this... Uh... There we go. Okay. I don't know what I did, but... Maybe I just needed to, like, land next to it. Don't mind us. Gonna walk past you, and then we got stairway down. Oh boy. I should probably. Eh, no. I was gonna say we should probably split Soren and Sarah to do one, and then 
Pete to do a second one, because he probably... No, they're all doing about the same damage as these. Never mind. I was thinking if he does like double the amount... Wow, bunch of stuff. Dual techs, cool. Oh, we're rescuing people. That's lit. I didn't realize we were going to be those kind of good guys. Uh, all enemies. Hell yeah. This pro this might kill them all. Because reptites are... No, not too bad. I was going to say, reptites are usually... Um weak to lightning, but I mean, maybe that it lowers their defense, like it did that one boss. That's what I'm guessing. We're about to have a feast, and you're about to be the roast beast. Oh god. Are they cooking humans? It's the apes! Uh, bubble burst, drop Sarah on an enemy. Hmm. Slurp Kiss is good, that's an AoE heal. Cool. They finally gave us an AoE heal that didn't involve uh, Clara. Not that we're trying to get rid of Clara or anything, but it is nice to know that we can be flexible without her being in the party. I feel kind of bad for Roa and Miss D. We never really used them. Nice. Two levels and a new skill. Two new skills? Wow. That's lit. What's happening? Kino, move back. Saris, save Kino. Oh, why, why are we doing it that way? Um. Okay. Hmm. Kino, sorry, all Kino's fault. It's okay. You take all Laruba persons and run. What did you do? Strong live, weak break, weak die. Sarah, we'll go be strong. All right, you'll go two. No come. God, this this dialogue sometimes I get get it, but saying it out loud is just like, uh, Sarah. Hell yeah. Break those bones. Sarah Strong. No lose. Kino, no. Kino, show you something. Follow Kino. Okay. Let's follow Kino, then. Oh. You strong, Kino weak, Kino jealous. Awesome. Ooh, that's a big chonky boy. I know there are other chonky boys. Uh oh. Lightning rod. Oh, that's cool. He uses the sword as a lightning rod. That's hella cool. Jeez, he's still alive? He really is a chonky one. God. Okay, there we go. Finally. Sitting here like, really? He took another hit for 200 and something? Damn. Cool mid potion. I don't know if this is necessary, but... Let's hit the little one first. So he has less things to throw at us. Cool. Now that's... Okay, is there something here? Oh, okay, we... Okay, interesting. Is this where Kino went, though? I didn't see Kino... ...yet. Since we've been up here. 
Okay, we'll just do one at a time, all of them attacking at once. I wish they weren't all attacking Soren, though. We'll just heal outside of combat. Why do the Reptites have, like, a castle? Like, that seems a bit, um, advanced for a bunch of dinosaurs. Okay, just one flyer. Wow, that was anticlimactic. I was expecting a bit more of a fight there when it stopped me. Oh, balls. What's happening? Okay, interesting. Let's hit the... the rock. Get that out of the way. I think he actively attacked the rock so it would start... What the heck? That's weird. Interesting combo. Do this, and then hit here. The lightning wrong attack is really cool. I'm really enjoying that. Cool. Cool. Kick some ass. Thick boy is out of the out of the game. Oh. Oh weird. Oh. Guess we can't go that way. Is this where we want to go? No. Okay, so that sends us back to the beginning. More stiff. Hmm. Another puzzle, you say? Wow, we got all kinds of stuff. Cool. Okay. Triceratopper? What? What is that? Okay, it's usable by pretty much everyone. Okay, well, what what are what are people using? Okay, cool. Free hat. Okay. Hmm. Maybe we were supposed. Yeah, because we started out over here. Maybe we're supposed to go this way. I think we are. It just looks so similar. Kill the rock. Oh, we already killed him. Wow. Okay. Can't go in there. Oh, well. Alright, more guys to kill. It's fine, we needed the, uh, we needed the practice. That's interesting, they attack each other. Hit that one. It's like they, if you attack them, if something attacks them, it affects the enemy. It's like when we attack it, it affects them. And when they attack it, it affects us. It's kind of cool. Okay, at least there's two of these flyers this time. Before it was kind of like, wow, what's even the point? Especially since they're pretty weak. Like, that was a, a single crit from Pete and it was dead.
Okay. Okay, so we could try the lightning rod again. Though I think just a regular lightning might be good enough. I think she did 600. Zoran leveled up. Pete leveled up. Yeah, this is some pretty good experience. Okay, I'm guessing it's the gate out here. Yeah. Wow, that thing must be hella strong. That little yellow guy just dropped the big guy onto the map. He was carrying him. That's crazy. Okay, we need to do a slurpy kiss. Which I know sounds delightful, but uh, a slurp kiss, rather. Which is what you get when you cross a prehistoric chick and a frog, apparently. And it heals for a lot. It heals more than Aura World. Ah, see, we needed to use lightning. That was dumb of me. Ooh, and we need to, uh... Heal Soren. Okay, we got another slurp kiss. Hopefully that's enough to keep us alive for now. It looks like it is. Then we'll actually play the fight correctly and weaken him with thunder first. Cool. Much better. Let's quickly use Kiss on Frogman. Of course. Kill one of the mountain guys, little volcano men. Such an interesting combo. The targeting order in this game always baffles me. Like, because, like, if you kill something and then you already have an action queued with someone else, it just feels like... Seriously? I just want to get through here. Uh, it feels like they, they pick one at random instead of going in a particular order, like left or right or clockwise. Be interesting. I would be interested in seeing the code for it. Oh god. Nisbel looking for Azala. She's just through here. Okay. How can I... Okay. So let's save. How are we doing on time? That would be a good place to stop, I think. We, uh, we're about to go into a new area, so I'm a little nervous, but in a good way, you know. So let's, let's save and call it a day. Next time we'll go in and face Azala, and it'll be a good time. Alright everyone, Edgelord Soren here. Hoping you have a fantastic day, make sure you check out the other series, like, comment, and subscribe to the video. And uh, I hope you have a fantastic day, and remember to stay edgy, my friends. Goodbye.